Hello y'all. Welcome to part two of my Socialist Republic of Italy Mussolini Path playthrough in the Hearts of Iron 4 mod Kaiser Redux. In part one, Benito Mussolini was made the leader of the SRI thanks to the events of the 4th Congress. And now we must select a national focus. Let us do Strengthen the Chairman. In order for the Republic to be strong, the Chairman must be strong. How can we help the people without the guiding hand of the chairman? The Congress is just an attempt to bring back bourgeois parliamentarianism, but the chairman shall rule, and the anarchist principles of the revolution shall be upheld, and this focus will be bypassed in less than a day. And now with that done, let us start doing the focus Ministry of Public Security. Enemies and counter-revolutionaries are all around us. In order to protect the people, the Ministry of Public Security shall be given all the power it needs to destroy the enemies of the Republic. And once this focus is over with, we'll get a national spirit which will grant us more daily political power gain. We'll also get more stability from this national spirit as well as less damage to our garrisons if we ever occupy any territory. So that's going to be starting out. That will take 42 days. And I believe, if I recall, we are attending a big third international meeting and it's mainly just a gathering of a bunch of left, well, syndicalist, radical socialist, and totalist groups. And there's like Latin America, the CSA, the Combined Syndicates of America, Women's Role in the Revolution. Let's go with whatever gives us base stability here. Come on, I need to see this. Stop. St I need base stability over political power. The alternative was 10 political power for 1% base stability. And, okay, White Terror denounced that. And is that all? research slot available. The end of the first Congress, the first Congress of the Third International has come to a close and the agenda has been met. Okay, select a technology to research. Let's start doing concentrated industry one. Get that done now. That would take 177 days. And how is this div division we are training doing? Okay, good. They have enough equipment. They should be deployed soon near the border of the Italian Federation. Well, the border we share with the Italian Federation and our goal in the long term is to eventually unite the, well, unite Italy. But before we can do that, we have to do a number of focuses to be able to use the decision to attack the Italian Federation. And in focus tree, let us do state atheism. And this is just the, the government of the Italian national social state, basically going against Catholicism, which is very big in the Italian peninsula. And this will take 42 days to complete now. And once this is done, we'll get 5% base stability and a, an event called Suppression of Catholics. And it's just, I guess, state atheism is going to be the government policy in terms of religion. And it, there's a coup d'etat in Siam. I have some planes in reserve, or they're not doing anything. Okay, we have 20 CR-32s. I need to do something with those. Not yet, actually. I'll be fine without them being stationed anywhere. And how is production of everything going good white sun over China. That's some book event, I think. We need more rifles, probably, and that division is now deployed. Someone restored order to Argentina. Stephen the Tent is elected as new pope. Is he the more, how to say, liberal-minded one? I'm not sure. There is some, there's a couple paths the Italian Federation can take after the starting leader dies that can lead them to unifying with the Socialist Republic of Italy, but I'm not certain. I think, no, that's not him. Yeah, it's this guy. Where is he? Busan Treaty. Where is he? He's right. Oh, he's right over... Oh, yeah, he's going to lead him down to a republic, isn't he? Oh, no, he's going to reestablish the monarchy. Okay, so we're going to be facing off against a kingdom of Italy down the line, probably. And the suppression of Catholics event has popped up since we're finished with state atheism. Suppression of Catholics. A number of highly placed Catholics who have been deemed at risk for supporting the papacy over their own government were recently rounded up by the Republican Guard today and placed in prison to, until such a time as they can be properly vetted. It's a move that should outrage other Catholics in the Republic, but should any trouble arise, the presence of so many ready informants when, will ensure that it is dealt with readily. It must be done for the greater good, and that's what the event there says. Now let's start doing the focus. We'll complete Rouse the People. We must rouse all the people of Italy to build a new Italy and spread the revolution. All battalion must be united. 
The people must join together in this fight and the many fights that shall come afterwards. And once this focus is done, we'll get a national spirit called Defense of the State, which will grant us faster mobilization speed, a higher recruitable population factor, more max volunteer force divisions, we can send more volunteers basically, and the popularity of totalism as an ideology will rise. And totalism is the ideology that Benito Mussolini adheres to. He is a national syndicalist, and that's just what he is politically. Condemn Pope Stephen X. And here we have the choice to do this or maybe don't do this. A conclave has elected Pope Stephen or Stephen X as the head of the Catholic Church and thus the ruler of northern Italy. We should condemn him as a potential danger to our nation. But the majority of our people are Catholic and might be upset. Even so, should we stand by and watch our own brethren be brain brainwashed into such unjust rule? And this is just what the event is saying. I'm just reading it as is. And we're very much the regime of Benito Mussolini in this mod is very much against Catholicism. And let us choose to say religion has always been has been the enemy of the proletariat. And this will cost us 100 political power. And the Italian Federation, they'll dislike us for this. And we'll also, they'll also get an event called The Commune Condemns the Pope. So, yeah. With that done, we have made our position clear, I hope. And now let's do the focus, Excavation 1. We will eventually clash with the Italian Federation at this rate. And Royalist Siam declared war on Parliamentarian Siam. That's over in Thailand. Well, what could be called Thailand. The Summer Olympics have occurred in Vienna. Now, what can I do? I can't, I don't, okay, I don't need to do anything right now. Just keep doing these focuses. Pa papal and Silical against Syndicalism. And this says here, Pope Stephen X has issued an outrageous and cynical condemning cynicalism and as a result our mainly Catholic population is growing increasingly restless and let us confiscate church property and this will cost us base stability actually no let us go no further I don't want to lose base stability to just deal with that yeah I'm not gonna do that at all just stand off on that one so he has this is his where's his part of the focus tree okay he can do this I don't know if he's gonna do it but he could do it We'll see, though. He will eventually try to reestablish a monarchy in that part of Italy. What focus is the Italian Federation doing? I have no idea. Okay, then never mind. And the Indo-Chinese Union is now fighting German East Asia. That's happening. The Kingdom of Cambodia has capitulated. Indochina declares independence. Yeah, that's the Indo-Chinese Union, essentially. And how's this division doing here? Good. Can I start making another one? Nah, I don't have enough infantry equipment. I'm not going to worry about it. And the Italian Federation has only like four divisions on the border. Two are infantry and the other two are militia. So we're watching out for them. So I'm just waiting for Rouse people to be done. Come on. A few more days. Come on. Get there. Get there. Get there. Get there. Come on. We need to keep going down this political part of the focus tree. Mussolini's branch, essentially. And now let's complete Scrogerdismo. I think that's what that says. Anyway, the Nationalistas have long have long promoted politically motivated workers to form militias under the well form militias indirectly under the chairman's control. This practice, known as Scrogernismo, shall be well should be enshrined in law. And it says here, well, it's going to give us a national spirit, which will grant us faster mobilization speed, quicker division training time, a higher division recovery rate. And we'll have more capacity for special forces divisions, so that's cool. We could have more, I guess, mountaineer troops. I don't even have a template for them, but oh well. But it just did not the, I guess the well. It's nice that we'll have the buff anyway, and that's going to be done soon. That's 42 days. All these focuses are 42 days. Once we get done with the part of this part of the focus tree, we'll start doing some army-related focuses. At least to the point we can complete military buildup, so we'll have to do we'll have to do prepare for liberation, whatever this focus here is, our DD del Papelito, and whatever this says over here, centralized command, integrate the Red Guards and dissolve the guards. And once the military buildup is complete, we can get ready for a war with the Italian Federation. Probably. Or no, we have to do even more focuses. At this rate it might be faster for us just to wait for world tension to get higher. Then we can justify on the we can justify war goal on the Italian Federation. I don't know though. 
And now we have some free civilian factories, build some civilian factories here in Campania, get that done now. I think the Italian Federation has a bigger industry than, do, than we do, but they got affected by Black Monday, which is an economic disaster. And Squadrodismo is done. Where is it? Where can I see it now? Okay, yeah, they have a bigger industry than we do overall. But like I said before, they got hit with Black Monday, which is a huge problem for them. That's a headache. And now let's complete Futurist Culture. And this focus says, The Futurist movement has become increasingly prominent in our nation. Futurism futurism encourages the total transformation of society for the promotion of the greater good and the rapid development of industry. We should encourage this movement as it aligns closely with our own goals for Italy. And once this focus is done, we'll get one research slot, an event called Rise of Futurism, and a national spirit called Futurist Society, which will make our divisions faster. They'll move faster. We'll lose some stability. We'll get faster infrastructure construction speed and faster military factory construction speed. And this is, I imagine, a parallel with how to say the futurist, the Italian futurist movement had with fascism. Well, it's said to have with, it's said to have had a kind of relation with fascism in real life, in our timeline, I mean. The Catholic Exodus, what is this about? So, it says here, ever since our government began its crackdown on Catholics, Many people have begun to immigrate north into the Italian Federation. The main artery for this so-called exodus is apparently the small border port of Anzio. Let us seal the border off and occupy Anzio. This will cost us political power, and it will also make the Italian Federation hate us. Which I'm not even going to beat around the bush there. They're not going to like that at all if we occupy Anzio. They're going to have to put up with it, or I think they can declare war to stop us from occupying it. We can see what they do. I am curious. Oh, he went to war with us. Yes, I want him to do this, actually. Because they have a smaller army than we, than we do, and they're busy watching the borders of the French commune, well, the commune of France. So this gives us an opportunity to storm in rapidly across the border we have with them near Naples and Rome. And we're going to try and overwhelm them as quick as possible. So moving all of the divisions now. Don't worry about the plane of navy. Just take Rome and move from there. Are you going to move any divisions away from the border? I don't think... Okay, they are. Yes. They move some away. I don't know if they'll move all of them. Britain's going to send us some rifles. Thank you. The Italian Federation is not part... They're not part of a faction at all. Be very aggressive here. Take more territory. Take anything that's not being defended, please. Norway has joined a third international. That is a big deal. So we took the city or town of Turning. Now we got to surround Latium. Just cut off these units in Rome. Moving here. Just go around Rome if you have to. Deploy these units now. We got to try and take as much industry as possible from the Italian Federation, as long as they're not defending some territory, we're going to dive in and take it. So, do I start getting some militia, perhaps? I don't know. I don't think I should. But keep attacking, though. And, okay, they moved some units down to stop us from advancing so rapidly. Mechanical computing is done. We did take a province, at least. We'll probably take Anzio soon. Keep up the pressure. Get radio researched, as well as... What is this here? Get this done. The Fiat, the Fiat Rivelli Modelo... 1914 and Brant Mortar, that is support equipment, so just keep attacking the Italian Federation. And now, the rise of Futurism. Futurism is an artistic social movement that emphasizes speed, technology, youth, and violence. It has emerged as a radical objection, a radical rejection of tradition, opposing both reactionaryism and liberalism. Founded by poet Filippo Thomas Marinetti, the movement has served as the avant-garde vanguard against Italy's traditionalist and socially conservative populist. It is for this reason that Marinetti has found himself an audience with Chairman Mussolini. Mussolini has admired futurism since its initial inception and hopes that by using this movement, the SRI can modernize its image. In response, Marinetti and other prominent futurists have pledged their loyalty and support to the Unione Nationalista. Let us race to the future. And now we have 30 more political power than we had before. And let's start doing the focus. Revolutionary commissars. Our armed forces, while brave and good, could be easily misled by reactionary elements. By establishing a core group of undoubtedly loyal soldiers and officers and embedding them in our military, we can ensure that our men remain loyal. And this will take 42 days. And once that is done, we'll get a national spear called Revolutionary Commissars, which will give our divisions more organization and a faster 
recovery rate. So that all sounds pretty good. Doctrine's available. Let's do superior firepower. Unlock it now. Yes, get that done. Research slot available. We got that from that futurist movement thing. The, yeah, futurist culture focus. So now let us start using this for, get, say, I don't know, get this artillery upgrade perhaps. Keep attacking the Italian Federation, who is on the defense right now. Take Anzio, then move on to Rome. If we can capture Anzio, that would be a big deal. They don't have enough troops to really stop us, so keep moving out. Get on as many fronts as possible. Here's some support from the Commune of France. Thank you for the rifles. If we can just rapidly expand our army, we will be able to overwhelm the Italian Federation before they even know what's going on. And the Commune of France canceled their lend lease with us. I don't know why. They just decided to do that. Use force attack. Keep pushing forward. We took Anzio. Rome is under threat. Pin down these units here. Make sure they don't reinforce the city. It must fall to us. It must. It shall. For the sake of Chairman Benito Mussolini, who will have his victory. Moving here. The fall of Rome has occurred, and this is a huge victory for national cynicalism, but we still have a long way to go until the Italian Federation is defeated for once and for all. With that said, I'm going to end what is part two of my Socialist Republic of Italy Mussolini Path played through in Hearts of Iron 4 mod Kaiser Redux here. If you enjoyed the mod, you can check it out in the video description. The link to it is there. If you enjoyed the video itself, make sure to like and subscribe.